Okay. Rafik Salah has the latest update about a school, uh, one of the leading secondary schools there. They say that um, they hold the bragging rights to be the champion for the National Science and Mass Quiz for this year. Started 25 years ago, the National Science and Maths Quiz is an annual competition that brings together students from the senior high school level across Ghana to display their science and mathematics skills. The annual event, which draws its competitors from each region of Ghana, is aimed at promoting the study of science and mathematics and also helping students to develop quick thinking among others. Venue for the Upper West Region event was was senior high school the 26 schools gathered at the school's assembly hall and in a group of five the price at stake is that the winners of the five groups will qualify to represent the region at the national competition group one comprised of saint ignatius of Loyola senior high school better known as last year to senior high was senior high technical school ulo senior high St. Francis Girls Senior High and St. Augustine Senior High Schools. Was Senior High, Nadolo Queen of Peace Senior High, Pina Senior High, St. Francis Xavier Seminary, Zafiema Senior High, and Ermo Senior High Technical Schools formed Group 2. The third group comprised of Nondam Senior High, Wat Technical Institute, Northern Star Senior High, Hen Senior High, Francis Senior High and St. John Senior High Schools, Canton Senior High, Watiyai Ahmadiyya Senior High, Holy Family Senior High, Wa Islamic Senior High, and Lambuse Community Senior High Schools form the Group 4. And the last group, comprised of Laura Senior High, Jiropa Senior High, Tumu Senior High, Brifu Senior High, and Wa Jamiat Islamic Girls Senior High Schools. So the stakes were high and the stage set for a tough contest between the schools. Quizmaster set the board rolling with group one. Your question. Large trees with huge ridges called buttresses in near the base. At the end of the two-day contest, St. Francis Xavier Minor Seminary, Nandam Senior High, St. Ignatius of Loyola Senior High, Jiruba Senior High, and Canton Senior High Schools qualified for the national event. St. Francis Xavier Minor Seminary has been a regular participant at the national competition. They have also reached a grand finale, but were unable to win the ultimate prize. They hope that this time round, they will be luckier. Having entered this competition, I don't think we would deserve to have any other expectation other than to win since we come from this institution and since that's our main aim. So, of course, we expect to go all the way and lift the trophy in the end. Are we not intimidated? There are people like us, there are students like us. I don't see why we should. So far as we're able to do this here, they present no threat to us, just like. Nandam Senior High School over the years have always qualified for the national competition but has never been able to win the ultimate prize. A tutor at the school, Master Ziema, has hopes of winning the competition this time round. We are going to work hard together with our students. Uh, as you rightly said, this is our golden jubilee year and we hope to bring the, the trophy to, to crown it with uh, our, our jubilee celebration. So we are going to, to work hard from now on. And we are not afraid of any school out there saying I'm a big school, no. Nandam Sec is well noted all over the country. Uh, there was a time before the establishment of UDS, Nandam Sec was called the Northern University, the pride of the North. So we are going to work hard and make sure that the cup this time around comes to Upper West Nandam and we'll crown it with our Golden Jubilee. Canton Senior High School will be making their debut in the competition. 
Organizers of the competition were impressed with the outcome of the competition and looking forward to the national competition in June. I think over the last three or so years, the National Science and Math Quiz has offered equal opportunity to, to all schools. It has always been like that, but it seems that now the schools that some people would have termed underdogs are also showing that they are, they are supremos in the competition. We've had schools like NIFA, schools like University Practice and others coming to eliminate even, uh, even former winners of the competition. So we know that this year being the 25th year, schools are going to show their best and we are also expecting a very exciting contest come June and July 2018. Reporting for the news, Rafik Salam. Wa. Wow.